Good morning, my kids. Today, let's start a new lesson. What is our new lesson? We are going to move to the third unit today. We are going to start a, a study about the windows. What is this window, darling? Okay, never mind. You don't know. I'll tell you what is it. Now, take your writing book. You have written some notes in your writing book. Open your book. Let's read your first point. OS means operating system is the software which controls the working of computer. You already know what are the softwares mean. The applications inside the computer are the softwares. So the operating system is the one who controls the computer. Now think for an example. You are watching cartoons. Who is making these cartoons? There are some other people who are making these cartoons. And you just switch on the computer, switch on your television and watch them. How do they come to the television? By the people who make them. And do they come in to uh, tell them about the cartoon? No, no, no. Those people, those uncles are not coming to your home and they are giving you the cartoon. It is going in the TV. So, TV is the middle person. TV is the middle person between us and the people who are making the cartoons. Likewise, the middle person in between us, the people who work with the computer and the people who make the computer is the OS. Without this OS, we don't know what is this computer, how it is working, how it's happened. So, it is the person, it is the middleman, the operating system is the middleman who help us to work with this computer. Okay, next point. Microsoft Windows is the most popular OS. Here children, there are many many operating systems in Havertes. But there is most popular OS nowadays. What is it? Its name is the Microsoft Windows. What it's called? Microsoft Windows. Now understand Microsoft Windows is a name of an operating system. It's not only the operating system. It's only a type of operating system. Can you understand? Let's move to the next part. Linux, Macintosh or some other operating systems. Ah, now look children, I told you. There are many, many other operating systems who help us to work with the computer. Some of them are Linux and Macintosh. They are also seen as the names. They are the names of operating system like Microsoft Windows. It is also a name of an operating system. Linux, Macintosh are also the names of operating system. What is the difference? Microsoft Windows is the most popular one and Linux Macintosh are not more popular as the Microsoft Windows. Next, process of loading operating system is called booting. Booting. Booting means process of loading the operating system. Ah. As when if you want to work with the computer, how do you work with it? You switch on the main power, you switch on the CPU, first of all you switch on the UPS, next the CPU, next the monitor, like this. Then how do it loading? When it's getting start. Loading means when it's getting start, there is a process. 
as soon as you switch on the main power can you see something on the monitor no there is a step there is a step that means it's called loading and it has a special name that way of loading is called the booting now children let's see how this loading going to be happen what is this booting i'll show you how the computer is booting let's see it okay let's see what how we are going to boot a computer now now see children what will going to be happen it says starting windows and some circular dots are coming that means it is booting or loading the operating system now you can see a playing background now it is operating it is booting it shows a circular motion circle that means we have to wait some more and it says welcome that means we are going to enter to the operating system now now we are in the computer surface ah. now it has finished loading after this we can work with this computer system thank you children this is the end of our lesson today let's meet up with a new lesson tomorrow next day